good afternoon. Got a second generation Prius in the shop today. The red triangle is on. It's got a P0A93. Uh, these throw that code when the inverter pump goes out. So I'm going to take you through replacing that right now. The pump is located right here in front of the fuse box on the driver's side. And it's held in with three bolts and then it's got two coolant lines going into it. So I'm actually going to clamp off the lines and I'm going to unbolt the inverter and kind of pull it out of the way. And you'll see what I mean here in a sec. Okay, so unbolted this, removed the bracket that was here, and then in the back there's a bolt that I loosen, then I don't remove it all the way, and it allows you to lift this and move it off to the side. And now you got a ton of room to work on getting this inverter pump out. So what I'm gonna do is clamp this hose and clamp this hose down here with these little hose clamps that we have so minimal coolant spills out and we'll get it out. Bye. 
And it's that simple. Old one's out, new one's going in. So I don't know what happens, but these things burn out. Oops, it's both pulling everywhere. These things burn out, and on the bottom here, it starts to melt. Sometimes you'll actually smell like plastic in this area uh, in front of the fuse box, and it sees things burning out. The other thing that can happen is when these start to short out, they will pop the AM2 fuse in the fuse box, and the car will be completely dead. Like you can't even turn it on. So that's one of the ways of knowing if this has shorted or not. You unplug this, replace the AM2 fuse, and then all of a sudden the car will start. So just important notes if you are uh, ever diagnosing one of these. But now this one's going back in. I got this all back together and it's as easy as that all I got all I gotta do next is just make sure that this is topped off after I run it for a second because we lost just a tiny bit of coolant but honestly it's really not that much it's probably not even gonna go down and I just got to put this plastic cover back on clear the code and it's ready to be picked up so another one done guys thanks for watching